Okay, out here at the farm. Come on, Minnie. Uh, my parents are moving away from this farm, so I gotta come get my stuff. I got a bunch of junk here that's gone now. I had all my sleds here. Um, now all that's left is the four-wheeler and the Elan. So you guys gotta untarp that. See if I can get it running. I got the wheels for the skis so I can drive it out of here. Hopefully there's gas in it because I didn't bring any two-stroke. And then the Honda. Check air box before starting. Oh yeah, there's a fucking rag. Last time I was... Oh god, don't tell... Oh, I left the fuel on. Oh, please say there's still gas in it. This thing leaks out the... Uh... Oh boy. Okay, well I do have some straight gas in my truck. Okay, there's some in there. I can hear it. All right, so let's uh, uncover this thing. Oh, come on, stand up. There we go. Oh, this tarp is so sun faded now. It did not look like this color before. It's almost brown. Now it's like pink. Okay. Put it in there, it'll blow away. Alright, there it is. It's pretty much exactly the way I left it. Throttle still operates. And it's still here, and it's pretty much exactly the same. But there's a crack here I developed over the winter, I think. So I'll be fixing that. All right, well, see if I can get this thing started. Actually, first I'm gonna make sure there's uh, petrol in it. Oh, almost died. Please say there's gas in it. Please say there's gas in it. I don't want to drag this with the four-wheeler. Well, there ain't much. As long as those hoses are in there, in the gas, we're good. Damn, that belt's skinny. Might have to replace that. At some point. Alright, well, let's see if it'll start. I'm gonna say it's gonna take me like 16 pulls. And I think it'll start. Alright, I got the secret sauce. Brake clean. Now you shouldn't really use brake clean when you draw it, when you're starting a motor with no gas because it's you know hard on the cylinder walls and then there's no lubrication for a few minutes while it's running. But it's a single cylinder skidoo. They last forever. They're hard to kill. Okay, here we go. Really? Is this stuff not flammable? I swear to God. Alright, well it started. Now, we've got to get fuel. Come on, pick up the fuel, damn it. Oh, I swear to 
god, if there's not enough gas in this thing. I mean, the fuel lines are in the tank, but like they're in the gas down in the tank, so. Serious, why won't you pick up fuel? Alright, I'm gonna try blowing through the tank and see if I can push fuel through the line. I can see it moving fuel now, so... Ah, here we go. Come on, baby! Give her a couple sprays. Okay, it lifts. I'll give it a minute. Put these wheels under the skis. Okay, bungee cords are on. Oh, I feel like I ran a marathon. I'm so tired. I knew I shouldn't have gone to bed at fucking 4.30 or 5 or whatever fucking time it was. Okay, so I gotta come back and get this. Load up the ELAN. Alright, let's see if it'll start and I'll drive it over there. I don't know how well this is gonna go with just me holding my cell phone, but I'm gonna do my best. Alright, that's hilarious. This, the wheels don't work well on anything, except this one. Oh, God! Oh, hello. Alright, so it's basically, this is just flapping in the wind, it's not doing nothing. But that was actually surprisingly fun. I'm gonna have to go tour around the yard. I'll see if I can set you up on something, because it'll be hilarious. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna fix some of the, I got a 
and make sure the seat's attached before I put it on the trailer. So I'll put that on the trailer and put the four-wheeler on the truck. And I'm going to patch this hole here, or crack, because that's pretty not good. But uh, if you drill a hole at the end of the crack, I mean, sure, you'll have a hole there, but you won't have, the crack won't, you know, spread all the way up. So I think when this first started, it was only cracked to here, and then it just kept going. So I'll drill a hole at the end of the crack, stitch it back together with some wires, and patch this back together somehow. So I at least have lights and stuff. So I believe this wire goes to the headlight. And then one of these other wires goes to the starter. And I taped it together in the winter in one of my other videos. And uh, I used Gorilla tape instead of electrical tape because that's all I had. But we'll get her going. And then I'll set you up so you can see me touring around the yard. It'll be, it'll be fun. Anyways, I better get to it. All right, I got... Everything's situated on the ELAN. Now we're gonna take it for a little spin and then load it on the trailer. All right, that's really fun. I'm, I won't lie, that's a lot of fun. But I don't want to run out all my gas because there's basically nothing in there. I remember now I siphoned some out so I could start another sled. And there's basically nothing in there for fuel. And if I keep running it around and burn up with a tiny little bit of fuel I got, I'm gonna have to drag it on here by hand and that's not gonna be very fun. So I'll get this set up. Yeah, I made this cool little rack for my trailer out of a quad rack. Eh, the welds are shit, but hey, they're strong. That up there. That over there. Uh, I don't know how, but I'm gonna set the camera up on something so you can see me uh, driving it up on the trailer. And Okay, there, should be good. I think we're good? Are we good? Yeah, we're good. Okay. So. The trailer tilts. You might not be able to see much with the trailer like that, so I apologize. But.
So hopefully when I go to tilt this, it doesn't just fall out of the trailer. Oh, it's going to fall out of the damn trailer. Ow, my leg doesn't stretch that far. Okay, so if I grab here... Oh. Oh, the weight just won't shift. No, don't fall all the way off, damn it. Okay. Let's try this again. And the foam fell down. So you guys probably missed all that. But it Damn it, I'm dropping everything. Okay, sled's on. See if I can get the tailgate closed. And I just fucking remembered I have to take this trailer off now. Because I gotta load the four-wheeler. Alright, well that's pretty much that's pretty much it for this adventure. Big chunk is drove all the way up here and hopefully she drives all the way back. Yeah, big chungus. But yeah, the truck does okay. Uh, I don't know, we'll see how it does with a bunch of shit on it. It's pretty underpowered with this little V6 and these giant tires. But the Elan don't weigh much, so. And the four wheelers, you know, not that heavy either. But she's all loaded. Make the journey back to the back to town. All right, I gotta go load more junk. Thanks for watching.